Hi everyone, I recently had the question in community asking where is connected variables, um, how do I get some sort of variable written back to a SharePoint column. Now in the old designer you did have um, where you could build variables and, and write them back to a SharePoint list. If you come to variables today uh, you create one, it's really just in the context of the form. The data is not written back to any column. This is something we're considering, but it's not in the product today. So how could you work around this? So I do have one suggestion. Uh, let's say I'm building up a simple form to say uh, first name and last name. So I'm going to say first name, last name. And I want to write back the full name to uh, the title column. So I'll put another one in here. And let's say visible is no, and call this full name and connect this to title. Now this is kind of a workaround until we do have connected variables but you know if you're in a bit of a tight spot this will definitely help you out. So first name and last name unbound and the full name is connected to title. So then you come to rules and you'd say uh, form rule uh, fill out full name field. I'd say uh, first name is filled and last name is filled then full name go to value and we'll go insert I want to say first plus last and done and then we'll also put an else condition in there so we'll say full name value is blank if those things aren't filled okay so yeah so if we come in here I put in Ewan Gamble you don't see anything that's fine so then we're going to go publish and close. And you see here I've already done one of these before so I was just testing before. Let's delete that one. Oops. And we'll go new. So I put in my first name and I put in my last name. You don't see the full name. Press submit. And there it is. So you don't have connected variables. However, you can use hidden controls to pass a value back to the SharePoint column uh, just using a formula. So hope you find that helpful. Let me know in the comments. Cheers.